Hey, what's up? I'm Olivia, aka BiblioGhoul, and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing the booktube newbie tag, even though at this point I've created more than a couple of videos, but my original footage for this tag got lost. So I will be answering the questions again. So let's get into it. The first question is, why did you start this channel? So obviously I love to read and I was feeling like I was doing a lot of consumption, especially in the pandemic, just like reading and watching things and it never went anywhere. So I thought it would be fun to create a YouTube channel and talk about some of the things I read and what I'm learning. Also, I really loved editing in high school, so I thought it would be cool to pick up an old hobby and use this channel to both talk about what I'm already doing and push myself to try some new things. What are some things I can bring to YouTube? What a question. Um, you know, there's a lot of booktubers. Can anyone really bring anything? Perhaps. I do read a lot of nonfiction and history though, and leftist history, so I will be reading some of that on the channel, which I don't think as much people talk about, but there's still people here doing that. Also, I think it'd be fun to try uh, some videos a la on Carly. I don't have anything interesting to say about celebrities in particular, besides ranting about why ugly men are married to beautiful women. I'm looking at you. I'm looking at you. But I just mean um, making videos and vlogs that uh, put a fun spin on books. For instance, a video you might see from me would be I read Carmilla the Gay Dracula and learned to play the organ. Okay, question three. What are you most excited about for this new channel? I am honestly most excited to get a community. Uh, I've moved around a lot in the past few years and have made friends and then been uprooted, but I would love to make friends in the booktube community and reconnect with my old friends that love to read. Also just excited to brainstorm ideas and conceptualize videos. Why do I love reading? I feel like a lot of people immediately say escapism and escapism is cool with me, but I mainly read because if I were a sim, any sims players in the house? Oh my god. Oh my god. Um, if I were a sim, my, one of my traits would be renaissance sim and I just like to learn a bunch of new things and use reading as a tool to read outside my own perspective. and just think about the world we have now and how people before me have reimagined the world both through like their lived experience and in fiction how they have built worlds that have operated differently. Yeah, okay. The next question is what got you into reading? Um, <laughs> can, can I not say a book and instead submit the answer of I wanted to be Matilda and read every book in the library. I love the summer reading challenge where you got little treats for every book you read and I I always like to like take on challenges so yes that. The Scholastic Book Fair. Like is this like the triple mecca here? Um, but yeah I don't know. When I was a kid I read kid things. I was reading stuff like A to Z Mysteries and Everything by Andrew Clemens. Uh, of course I went through the twilight phase as a lover of all spooky things. There was also this amazing book in my library where there were like hieroglyphics on the cover and you could travel to like different parts, places in time based on what you turned the book to. Um, that, this is not a great description, but, um, yeah, I mean, when I was a kid, I guess I liked history. I wish that I knew in middle school and high school that I liked history. Maybe if they had taught social history instead of just talking about war and documents, I would have enjoyed it. What question would you ask your favorite booktubers? I don't know. 
I'd probably read Noelle a knock-knock joke. I also love books with Chloe, Sage Reed, Sunny Book Nook. Oh, bow ties in books is a new favorite. I would ask them all where they find their more unconventional books. I just mean by that books that everyone on YouTube isn't reading since it becomes kind of an echo chamber of recommendations. What challenges will be the hardest to overcome? Well, there's the fact that I say um and like every other word. The first video I made when I was editing it, it was like <laughs> um, <laughs> Yeah, I'm just a person that either waits to talk until I know exactly what I'm going to say or talks out loud, so I'm learning how to use my voice better through this YouTube experience and I know that's going to be a challenge. Also, the time to film videos as I have three jobs currently. Ugh. But you know, I stopped dreaming of work. When did you start reading? I don't know, as soon as I could, as soon as I learned to read, I just went with it and was reading everything. Um, is there another answer to this question? I guess I did get back into reading after grad school when I wasn't reading five million things. Where do I read? I re read scrunched up in a little ball of blankets in my bed, which is where you will find me as much as humanly possible. That's just the Taurus in me. I'm feeling a little adventurous, feeling a little spicy. I like to um, take my ass down to the sea the river, any body of water, and feel the wind in my hair, and feel like the universe is speaking to me as I read my book by the sea. <laughs> so yeah, this is what you're getting yourself into. Subscribe. Lastly, what kind of books do I like to read? I like to read speculative fiction. As I said before, I care about reimagining society and operation of the world. I like a good romance, as long as there is as much steam as romance. Um, horror books, especially anything gothic, anything in a haunted house, ghosts, supernatural, all that. I dig it. Because the truth is out there. I love reading queer content, again, history and nonfiction, and just fiction in general. Anything really lyrical. I love Claudia Rankin. I love Aquake Mezzi. So yeah, that's me in a nutshell. If you're new to booktube like me, leave a comment and um, I'll subscribe to your channel so we can be friends. But yeah, everyone else, like, subscribe, you know the deal baby. And I'll see you in another video. Bye!